So this is now the Eiffel Tower of of Saskatchewan. Paris Prairies. Oh, look at the tower. Happy Canada Day, everyone! We greet me naman for my 10 years anniversary. Yeah, happy, happy 10 years anniversary for the founder and the owner. the owner of Biko Pomor, the very popular Biko Pomor in YouTube channel of Jolly Dale. So it's her 10 years anniversary. Happy 10 years, Biko Pomor Amor! Hi, thank you! <laughs> uh, what's the most? Uh, this is a, a Q and A portion now. Okay. What's the most uh, unforgettable experience you have in your ten years here in Canada? The most unforgettable uh, day I have here in Canada is celebrating Canada Day. Perfect. Because we're always going out in the province, discovering Canada. It's very awesome. Wow. Amazing place. That's really great. Yeah. So Canada Day is the celebration of all the Canadians celebrating. The, is that the independence of Canada? Yes. I yeah, will ask this to bright students and one bright student, uh, one little girl there. <laughs> What's the reason why uh, Canada is celebrating Canada Day in July 1? Uh, how many years of independence now? 151 or 2. Oh, 151 or 52. But the Philippines has like 122. Yeah, that's Canada Day. It's quite a long time now. How about the little girl? Do you know about Canada Day? No. What do you know about Canada? Do you like Canada? Why? <laughs> you don't like Canada? Okay, <laughs> she's a Filipino still. How about Dale? Dale is a Canadian. Why are you crying, Dale? Oh, because we stop. Dale always cry when the car stops. He wants it to be keeps on running. Yeah. How about Mom? You are wearing red. Is that because of Canada Day? Yeah. Or oh, you are twinning with Dale? Twinning with my son. Yeah. You're tuning also? Okay. Guys, we're so excited because we're going to what they called as Little, little Paris of Saskatchewan. You will see the Eiffel Tower there. Watch out for that Eiffel Tower. Let's see the difference between the Eiffel Tower in Paris and the Eiffel Tower in Saskatchewan. Be amazed, guys. Watch out later. And now we are driving. Same with our great driver the blonde yes. beautiful nancy yes. Yes. and we have the assistant the biko pamor order biko pamor please yeah <laughs> just text or call 306-216-6267 please yeah okay. only in regina okay but all those people are asking for biko pamor from saudi arabia watch out guys we'll have an international delivery of biko pamor just oh, wait yeah, for your that's time. Coming soon. Yeah, that's coming soon. We're working it out. Don't wait for your yeah, time. Now it's better to waste your time. Uh, so this is Princess Taya TV. Uh, uh, introduce or promote your vlog, your your channel in YouTube. What's your channel in YouTube? Princess Taya. Okay. How many videos do you have in your channel? Mm -hmm. Only one. Okay. Guys, don't also forget to like, subscribe, and watch the video of Taya, Princess Taya TV in YouTube Kids. So we will have a collaboration between Jolly Dale TV and Princess Taya TV. And guys, thank you so much for at last we have reached already 4,000 watch hours in Jolly Dale TV. And soon we'll be monetized. from Princess Taya so you have to wash your hands all the time you could keep you know, like a sanitizer you could use the sanitizer to keep COVID-19 away okay guys 
watch out later we're still traveling right now we're still here in Regina and soon we'll be there in I don't know the name Montgomery it's like a geometry <laughs> but we'll see what's the name of the place okay I'm new here and I gotta really pronounce the words okay How many hours travel from here to the little Paris of Saskatchewan? About two hours. It's like one, one hour, hour or two hours? One hour only. Uh, so it's only one hour guys. So it's just like a short trip because we usually travel two to three hours. So that's usually the duration of our travel. But this one is just like one hour. It's just a short travel. What? <laughs> we have money. Well, you need money? <laughs> what is that? We need money. Yeah, we need money. That's why we're vlogging. Guys, you you support our vlog. We support our channel. And it's almost 4,000 watch hours. I think it's already it reached already 4,000 watch hours as of this morning. And I have monetized my vlog, my, my YouTube channel. And I'm just waiting for the approval of YPP partnership of YouTube. Okay guys, later, let's see if we are approved. But sometimes it would really take time. But meantime, we will enjoy our travel going to the little Paris of Saskatchewan. See you later. Bye-bye. So it's a little Paris in the city of uh, in, in, the, the of in the province of Saskatchewan. Look, look at that one. So it's like that we are in in it's like that we are in France. See, look at that. And this is a little Paris, like a little Eiffel Tower. It's an Eiffel Tower. So let's see what's the history of this little Eiffel Tower. Okay, what do you call this one? It's in memory of this people. Okay. So this is the history. In, 19, in 1892, settlers moved here from the Montmartre suburb of Paris, France, and named the community after their homeland. The slogan Paris of the Prairies was thought of by the local farmer Lloyd Fink. In 2009, this slogan and image of Eiffel Tower were used to commemorate Montmartre 100th anniversary celebration. A call was put in an edition of the community's monthly newspaper, The Positive Post Requesting Paris Theme Ideas. Mamory Inglot read the request and his mind began to race. Having grown up on a farm in the Montmartre area, the entrepreneur wondered if, if his company had what it took to build the centerpiece of the Paris theme, an Eiffel Tower. Inglot's company created an Eiffel Tower replica out of steel and donated the labor and materials for the 8.5 meter, 3,600 kilogram, three-dimensional tower. Within a month, the ground was labeled. 
The concrete base was made, the Eiffel Tower was created, welded and painted and lighted were installed. All the people involved in this project originated from Montmartre area and over $27,000 worth of material labor were donated. An official unraveling the tower was held in July 2009, just one day prior to Montmartre homecoming celebration. So this is the history of Montmartre. Montmartre or Montmartre, I don't know how to pronounce this one. So that's the history guys. And look at the Eiffel Tower. So this is the little Eiffel Tower, so it's like a Paris, city of Paris. So what can you see about the Eiffel Tower, Thea? <laughs> what can you see about the Eiffel Tower? Meaning that it's, it's just like it's the history is they copy the the place in in France which is called Montmartre. Oh. So they also named this uh, uh, Paris Prairies, like a small Paris in, in Prairie. Prairie. Yeah. So, but actually the history is all the people who build that is from France, Montmartre. So they build it as a replica of what is in Paris. So the people also living here are coming from Paris. So that's why they have mailed a build uh, like a replica of uh, Paris so they could really feel like home. So they will really feel like home because of the Eiffel Tower. So it means to say because there's also like this kind of thing in the in in, in Eiffel Tower that's the city of France. Paris France is 6880 kilometers away. So when you go to the Eiffel Tower you could see also this one. So it's just like a replica mm -hmm. and a little uh, Aromins. Aromins is just like uh, you know uh, uh, yeah the city is going to the Paris yeah it's just like same in Paris France but there's no uh, Paris actually how what can you say about this little France day uh, uh, Paris. Baby. <laughs> yeah, nice. So this is now the Eiffel Tower of of Saskatchewan. So they called it as a Paris Prairie.
yes Let's go to day round. So this is called Parish of the Prairies. So it's a nice guy. It's like a monument. Oh, let's go to it. Let's go. Let's find out what the monument. It's a memorial.
Hey, can you understand me? Yeah, Konica. 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 Konica.